Hi, this is Jack again. So I ended off in my previous interview where I said each and every single expression in existence have two choices in every moment with every breath, self-honesty or self-dishonesty. Now, it's taken us in the dimensional existence two and a half years to just realize this point, that existence and ourselves have been responsible for what's been happening because our starting point has been of self-dishonesty and not self-honesty. So, we're currently here on Earth applying self-honesty in directing and supporting human beings as one with ourselves through the exact same process we've been through in the dimensional existence for you to start realizing this point. Now, at the moment, it's knowledge and information that I'm showing with you. Self-honesty, self-dishonesty in every moment with every breath. Um, now let's just take that further into a beingness of yourself. Self-honesty. Self-honesty will bring forth heaven on earth. Simple. Yes. Now, the changes that has been happening and the process that is currently on earth is the following. Um, for a moment the dimensional beings was, now before we um, realized the self-honesty, self-dishonesty point, um, the dimensional beings were assisting and supporting human beings accordingly, you know, standing as all as one is equal in every moment, <clears throat> but it didn't want to work effectively. We got stuck every time, we fell every time, we got frustrated, we got angry because we're doing everything we're possibly able to, but human beings just aren't budging. And we're not making an effective effect. Uh, we're not having an effective effect. So, <clears throat> what happened was the following. Nature and the animal kingdom took our place. For a moment. So, for each and every single human being, there is a tree. And an animal from the animal kingdom on earth, assisting and a fairy. And then all of us in the dimensions, all dimensional beings who dimensional beings have ever been in the dimensions and also still crossing over from Earth, decided to swap and reverse roles. So we integrated then with nature in the animal kingdom. Why do that? Because we did not yet know or understand how to practically actually assist and walk with human beings on earth because we've never done it. We've never actually walked with human beings in every moment practically and directed you accordingly to support you and assist you in realizing yourself as life as all as one and equal. Um, and so we decided to integrate into the animal kingdom and nature um, because there we're able to stop first focusing on ourselves and birthing ourselves as life from the physical. And then from there, once we've experienced it as ourselves, this is humanity. It's common sense. From that perspective, nature and the animal kingdom has already done that. In other words, they are life. They are standing as one and equal in self-honesty with themselves as who they are in every moment. And it's interesting because what did it actually state? That nature and the animal kingdom are more aware than human beings and even dimensional beings. In terms of the practical, living, expressive application of themselves in every moment is life. And so we were in the animal kingdom and nature, but still, no change. We just couldn't do it. We were in the animals and in nature, which is interesting for a moment. You know, there's no difference in terms of where we are or where we're, we're placing ourselves or where we're experiencing ourselves, yet we still couldn't get to the application. We couldn't get to the practical method of, you know, birthing ourselves as life from the physical and all is one is equal. Then came the point of self-honesty and self-dishonesty. We realized that there is no way that you're able to birth yourself as life from the physical, practically expressive, that you stand infinitely if your starting point is of self-dishonesty. Yes, what we realize is that 
whether we're in the animals or supporting and directing human beings, it's irrelevant. If your starting point is not self-honesty in every single moment, and you've proved that to yourself, there's no way you can birth yourself as life from the physical. Yes, you may stand as all as one as equal and, you know, apply yourself accordingly, but that means bullshit. That means nothing. If your starting point from that standing of who you are as all as one as equal is not a beingness, an isness of yourself from your starting point of self-honesty. So, then we went, okay. So all of us came together, all the interdimensional beings, nature, the animal kingdom, the dimensional beings, all of us came together and said, okay, let's place ourselves accordingly to our own self-honesty of where we are able to practically assist human beings here on earth to assist and support them in the realization of who they are as all as one as equal from the starting point of self-honesty. Now, we've done that. <clears throat> so there's some dimensional beings that are again with human beings. There's still the trees. Um, there's a tree for each being that remained. Um, there's an animal and some children, some dimensional beings, so we're all mixed. And it doesn't matter anywhere whatsoever. The beings who cross over, um, they also have a choice of where they are, where they're able to apply themselves practically, a starting point with, for themselves in the dimensional existence. And then according to that, they'll place themselves in existence to immediately assist and support human beings <coughs> in realizing themselves in the differentiation between self-honesty and self-dishonesty. And that's what's been happening recently. Um, so, self-honesty and self-dishonesty. Now, here's an interesting perspective. I cannot explain to you or even show you or even reveal to you what your self-honesty and your self-dishonesty is. That you have to define for yourself in every moment with every breath of application. That's your own process, your own individual process. Though, to point out another change that has been manifested in existence, there's no more a unified consciousness field. That's out. Removed. Each being's world and themselves have been inverted completely. So human beings can start facing their own creation of dishonesty. Now realize this. I'll continue in my next interview. Thanks.